My name is Taylor, and I'm Lucas, and this is Tech Reviews for You. So let's get right into this. I'm going to go ahead and read the specs off of the QC25, the over your headphones. It's got a microphone, you can play, pause, skip your music, all that good stuff. It's over ear cushion cups, it runs on AAA batteries, and noise cancellation. That's the biggest feature on both of these headphones. We're going to test that out for you guys and let you guys know what we think of it. Well, so let's open in that. I'm going to read myself of the QC20. I mean, basically, same stuff as that. Besides, it has in the ear style, the over the ear. This um, design is called Stay Here Tips, which makes it way, com way more comfortable in the ear and let us stay in your ear better. Yeah, everything else, same with like, has a microphone, volume up, volume down, play, pause, rewind, skip forward. So, knees up too. We're gonna go for these first, do it. Figure out where to put this AAA battery. Here we got the battery put in. They provide you guys that, so that's nice. And then we're gonna go ahead and test these out and tell you guys how they sound. Here, try one. So first impressions on how comfortable they are. I mean, when I put them on, it felt like nothing was really there. So I mean, that, I mean, I guess that's a good thing because like you never felt them. Right. So I, that I get like I get like a nine comfortability with it. Um, I mean, these are probably some of the most comfortable over ear headphones that I've tried. If you guys can relate, like whenever I've had them before, like they kind of like scrunch your head, you know, like after like a couple hours. But I feel like these you could wear for like a whole plane ride. These are really really nice. I feel like in the, I mean, the build quality I think is like superb. Same. So if you guys can see here, in order to have the noise canceling on these in ear, you gotta be able to turn this button on down here and it charges micro USB. Is that micro USB? Yeah. Micro USB. So you gotta make sure that you guys turn that on in order to activate the noise cancellation. So I'm gonna try it without the noise cancellation and then turn it on to see how it sounds. All right, try them out. Again, comfortability, how do they feel? I mean, I had a kind of like a rough time putting it in my ear. I mean, take a few seconds to get it in, but I mean, that's fine. But yeah, I mean, same comfortability as uh, Q25, QC25s. We're good. Um, whew, yeah, they're comfortable. What do you think? Um, I mean, to address the problem that you had, I know they come with different ear fins. So let everyone know that these pieces right here, depending on how big or how small your ear is, which might have been your problem, that you can definitely change those out. But I, I thought they were comfortable. They they felt pretty good. They went in my ears pretty well. All right, after listening to both of them, which one do you think sounds better? Um, I personally go with the over ear 25, and the reason being is that you can definitely get a full richer sound. By that, it's like the low end is there a little bit more, and you can definitely tell whenever you try on these and then go right to those. You can definitely feel and hear a little bit of different. So, what are your thoughts? I mean, per to me personally, I think these sound a little bit better but i mean due to like the the look and the style i'm gonna go with those over these just due to that so who would you recommend these to um i love these as all around headphones and i know the noise cancellation is their biggest factor like we said over and over in the video so i see that personally unlike anyone who travels a lot but i'm sure these headphones can do great in car rides road trips any of that sort I'm sure they'd do great just casual listening because you're able to block out the sound, any of that stuff. So to round it out, I mean, I advise these to pretty much anyone who's looking to upgrade headphones. I don't know if I'd say go out and spend all your Christmas money the next day and pick these up because they're the best headphones ever, but, but I definitely like them. I'm going to keep them around. I think they're going to be my go-to headphones now. So keeping the price in mind, which one or both do you give their approval to? I mean, for me, I give their approval to both of them. I mean, just because they both sound great. They both look great. I mean, comfortability, I'll give this one uh, one up on it. Due to that, I'll give this a more of an approval than this. But thank you guys so much for watching Terry Reviews for you. 
This is like our 17th video now. I, somewhere around there. We are killing it. 100 are, subscribers. We never said thank you guys for that. Thank you guys. What am I saying? <laughs> thank you guys. But I mean, that's really an accomplishment. We thank everyone that watches the channel personally. I mean, we love doing this and we're happy that at least 100 of you guys like Again, thank you guys so much for 100 subscribers. We're going to keep pushing out videos every Monday and Thursday and hopefully some extra ones if we find time. Thanks for watching another episode of Tech Reviews for you.